First, take out of all items from the package. The package includes monitor, camera, DC power cord, U bracket, sunshade, windshield mount, cigarette lighter adapter, antenna, T connector and screws. Follow my operation. Install the antenna on the monitor. Loosen the screws. After adjusting the angle, tighten the screws. Take out the 3M sticker. Tear off the 3M sticker. Paste it on the bottom of the monitor bracket. You can tear off the 3M sticker. Paste the monitor where you want. Pick up the windshield mount. First remove the U-shaped bracket. Follow my operation. Pick up the windshield mount. Loosen the screw. Align the bracket with the hole on the back of the monitor and slide it in. The position of the bracket can be flexibly adjusted. After adjusted the angle, tighten the screws. The bracket can be flexibly adjusted. You can install the monitor on the windshield. Pull down the buckle to fix. After adjusted the angle, tighten the screws. Follow my operation. Take up the power cord. Connect the power cord to the monitor. Take up another power cord. Connect the power cord to the camera. Follow my operation. Take up the green connector. Use a tool to loosen the screw. The plus sign is positive, minus sign is negative. Insert the merged red wire into the positive, plus, slot of the green connector. Tighten the screws. Insert the merged white wire into the minus, slot of the green connector. Tighten the screws. Then, plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the green connector. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power. Press the red button. The red button lights up. Follow my operation. The monitor lights up and the image appears on the screen. Pick up the camera. The camera has 16 lights. This is the sensor. Cover the camera with your hand and hold the automatic light sensor with your finger. You can see IR light. Follow my operation. The testing finished. Now disconnected all the wires. The easiest way is connect the monitor to cigarette lighter outlet. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power. Press the red button. The red button lights up. The monitor lights up and the screen shows no signal. The red wire is connected to the positive wire of the tail light or 12 volts DC power system. The white wire is connected to the negative of the tail light or 12 volts DC power system. The image appear on the screen. Pick up the camera. The camera has 16 lights. This is the sensor. Cover the camera with your hand and hold the automatic light sensor with your finger. You can see IR light. Follow my operation. Now introduce the function of the monitor. The first key is used to turn on, off the screen. The second and third keys have no effect in this case. Touch the CH key to switch the camera to channel. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 3 channel. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 4 channel. Ouch the CH key again to switch the split mode. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 1 channel. In the split screen state, touch the menu key cannot enter the menu mode. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode.
The first icon is for pairing signals. This system does not need to pair signals when you received, because it has already been paired. You just need to pair with the monitor when connecting new cameras. Touch the OK key to enter the pairing countdown. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image appears on the monitor, means pairing is successful. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the picture. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key. The icon turns red. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the brightness. Touch the OK key to confirm. The icon turns yellow. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the volume. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the volume. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the menu key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the mirror flip. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to select the mode you want. Touch the menu key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the mode. Touch the OK key to confirm. You can choose the split mode you want. Follow my operation. Touch the up or down keys to select the last button. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touches the menu key to quit the menu mode. Touches the CH key switch the camera channel. The scan appear on the screen. The monitor will automatically switch channels. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the cam setup. Touch the OK key to confirm. You can turn off the single channel screen. Touch the OK key. Touch the up or down keys to turn off the camera one. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touches the menu key to quit the menu mode. Touch the CH key to switch the camera two channel. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 3 channel. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 4 channel. Touch the CH key again to switch the camera 2 channel. The image of camera channel 1 is not displayed now. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the cam setup. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key. Touch the up or down keys to turn on the camera 1. Touch the OK key to confirm. The image of camera channel 1 is displayed now. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the cam setup. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the scan time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the scan time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn on, off the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Follow my operation. The scan appear on the screen. When you have pictures for both channels, the monitor will automatically switch channels. Follow my operation. When the camera 2 has not image, the monitor will not automatically switch channels. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the system. Touch the OK key to confirm. The first button is used to adjust the system time. Touch the OK key. Adjust year, month, day, hour, minute, second in turn. 
Touch the up or down keys to adjust the system date. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the language. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to select the language you want. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the FPS. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to select the NTSC or PAL. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the auto dim. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn on, off the auto dim. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the delay time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the delay time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the P line. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn on, off the guidelines. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. Now demonstrate how to insert the SD card. Turn off the monitor's power. Follow my operation. Use tools to remove the back cover. Insert SD card. Tighten the screws with tools. Turn on the monitor's power. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the play. Touch the OK key to confirm. SD card information is displayed here. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. Touch the OK key to turn on the record. The rec appear on the screen. The monitor is recording. Touch the OK key to turn off the record. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the play. Touch the OK key to confirm. This is the video playback list. Touch the OK key to turn on the video. Follow my operation. Touch the menu key to return the video playback list. Touch the menu key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the record. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key. Touch the up or down keys to turn on the rewrite. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. The monitor shows this icon. After the rewrite function is turned on, if the memory card is full, the video recorded before will be deleted automatically, and then the video will be recorded again automatically. Touch the menu key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the record. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the format. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn on the format the SD card. Touch the OK key to confirm. Please format the new SD card first. Formatting is complete. Touch the menu key. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. Touch the OK key to turn on the record. The rec appear on the screen. Touch the OK key again to turn off the record. Touch the OK key again to turn on the record. Touch the V key to quickly view the video playback list. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole.
camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom, 